So Dan, if I could ask you quickly about that, um, would you support legislation that would prevent ICE from operating in New Hampshire? Like they do these checkpoints on New Hampshire roads up in uh, Littleton, the, uh, on 993. Wasn't there a there's a lawsuit against right? ACLU's. There was a lawsuit related to drug seizures related to those checkpoints, but um, some cases were thrown out where they had seized drugs from people that were stopped because they were using like drug dogs, and they said that no, the ICE's purview is just supposed to be looking for undocumented immigrants. Um, Let me talk to ACLU about all that stuff. They're but, the experts. But they, even though the court ruled on that. Yeah. So I thought that was kind of a mamby pamby answer, is a, a quick take from that. It seems like Dan was kind of hesitant to talk to me, um, or maybe hesitant to go on the record, like on the camera. I mean, he was holding up the sign that said, free them, presumably about the kids being kidnapped. But what I wanted to ask him specifically was, would he support legislation to stop ICE from operating in New Hampshire and stop them from doing these checkpoints on the roads? Because right now, let me try to get in better light. Right now, up in I-93 in Littleton, they occasionally, every so often, usually during the busiest traffic weekends in, uh, of the summer, they set up these checkpoints on the highways and they stop everyone. Uh, doesn't matter if they think you're an immigrant or not, everybody gets stopped. And then they do their little inquisition into who's an immigrant. Now, they had been doing drugs, uh, like, drug searches with dogs then. That wasn't what I was asking about, and there were a few people that were arrested for drug-related things there. Um, but I was interested in just shutting these things down altogether, not having their purview specified to this sort of search or that sort of search. They shouldn't be looking for immigrants. Um, they shouldn't be looking for drugs. That's not the Fed's job to be in this, in this state, stopping everyone, finding out what their status is, etc. So I was hoping uh, to get Dan to say yes or no, he would support legislation that says, ICE, you cannot have your checkpoints here. Uh, we do not authorize it on our roads. We don't care if they're federal roads, whatever. Even if that means stopping the uh, federal funding for these highways, because that's probably what the federal government would threaten. We're not giving you any of the highway funding. Um, but obviously, that it doesn't matter if it's a political football or not. This is a morality issue. Um, Nobody, undocumented, documented, American citizen, non-citizen, should be stopped for travel on New Hampshire roads. Every person in New Hampshire should have that right. And uh, I was hoping that Senator Feltus would be a little clearer on that because he is a New Hampshire senator. He's one of the, what is it, 23 people that have uh, that level of power to be passing laws here in New Hampshire and obviously very much the capability to uh, in, uh, create and pass these laws. So. Why isn't New Hampshire doing more at the state level to resist these terrible things going on at the federal level? But uh, that was my question, and I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video.